Hello everybody, it's Kamek60. And yes, this is Planet Coaster. And as you can tell, I already made a coaster. I run you ran you through it. I built some theming to it, but today we're gonna be fixing some of that theming. And we're gonna be making some but you know, today we're not going to be fixing any theming. Someday we'll fix this part out. But for today, I'm going to be sharing some tips and tricks that I learned from another game called Disney Infinity that you could use in Planet Coaster. Now, this isn't the second roller coaster I made. This isn't the third. This isn't the tenth. This is actually the first roller coaster that I have made so far. So, anything that I'm doing today will be experimental, but at the same time, I played similar games such as Disney Infinity and a little bit of Royal Coaster Tycoon 3. Probably a lot of it, but not as much as my brother. But I played enough of Disney Infinity of making uh, buildings and levels, basically 3D levels, to have a basic idea of what I should be doing here to make some nice unique buildings and hopefully help you guys out making your own buildings in Planet Coaster as well. Some of the things that you can make in Planet Coaster I've seen have been super crazy and super high, de high detailed but something that I learned from Disney V that is even though you have the resources if you haven't done it yourself you can't really do it. So practice 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 is the best thing you could do to get really good at the game and hopefully I will be able to give myself enough time to make some really nice roller coasters. At the moment, I'm not thinking I'm going to be making parks, but we'll see we'll, we'll see where I end up when I'm done making some coasters. I think I'm, I think I'm satisfied with how the board, boarding station is looking. Oh, shoot. We got lost. Sometimes I get lost with this camera. Gotta get used to this as well. But yeah, so far I think the boarding station is looking good. Looks generic enough. It looks detailed enough. Oh, we're missing a light in there, but we'll get that some other day. Alright, so let's get to the meat of the episode, which will be making buildings. I'm going to make some basic basic shapes using the concrete. And when I'm done with that, I'll be right back with you. Alright guys, I think we made some nice templates for our future buildings. I wanted to have possibly a nice tall fin building. A uh, big beefy square building. And then we have a long short building. 
more rectangular, more rectangular than these buildings are. And now that we got the basic shape, now let's make them actually look like buildings by putting a roof on top and giving them some windows, giving them some doors, stuff like that.
All right, something I noticed that you probably already know is I forgot to make these separate buildings in which the game is going to think that this is all one building instead of three separate buildings. So I think what I'm going to do you to fix this is I'm going to click done. I don't want this anymore, so I go click like that. Click on the building. We uh, let's do duplicate. <laughs> We're gonna duplicate the building three times. Well, two times. I make three copies. And then we're going to edit each one and delete one building at a time. Now we got that fixed. Alright, something that I would do change in the future is probably figure, change how I build my walls. got to keep in mind that for some reason the game likes to have the textures glitch through though. The walls, even though they should not be visible. I guess not, they shouldn't be visible. I don't want them to be visible, but for some reason the game kind of sort of wants them to be visible. Hi guys, while I'm editing this video, I decided to cut it up into two parts. I apologize, but I definitely think that this is the better way to go. So that the, um, the video doesn't go on too long. First segment was building these buildings, and the next segment will be spreading out the buildings and putting them into the coaster as a template on how I want the buildings set up, and also giving them a little bit of detail. As always, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe. Both will help the channel out grow. And until next time, this is Cam60 signing out.